guys, welcome to here once again. What's up, everybody? What? Transcending history in the world, a tale of kingdom hearts, eternally retold. I'm just saying that because the voice actor in this is the narrator for Soul Calibur. We're here, actually playing it. Wow, we! It's a showcase of a DLC character who really shouldn't be DLC by all means, since they've been here since what three? Yeah, they've been here since three. It's the case of um, Street Fighter all over again, like but jagged, yeah. but whatever, whatever, man. If you want to just nickel and dime us for characters that already existed, we ain't gonna say no because we can create Bowsette in this game. We don't care. By the way, she looks amazing. By the way, yeah, I was about to say on the waifu scale, how how, okay, how waifu scale? Okay, a solid A. Even though she has like um um bi personality, dual personality. Oh, um, it's. She's all happy in one personality, and then she even it reflects it in her fight style. She like changes styles, and she gets all like angry and stuff. And she's happy right now. <laughs> Very schizo, I think, is what I was going for. Cause I was I was trying to think of the term for what that like dual personality type of dealio was, but I cannot remember it for the life of me. <laughs> yeah, cool woman specifically put this guy, he's like the god like of this game apparently. Yes, no, he he's literally more flamboyant Zamasu if you ever get the chance to play the game and like through his story or whatever. Cause he literally wants to save humanity by destroying them. Just like Zamasu, except he's a lot more flamboyant with it. And you thought Rose was really flamboyant. Uh -uh. <laughs> this guy. Mm. This guy. So how long have you been fan? So how long have you been fan of the series, my friend? Ever since like two. I've been a fan since four, which according to Koop, a lot of people, of course, they kind of started dropping off. Uh, it's it's nothing against the game itself. It just kind of I would say it was more the fault of Soul Calibur three because there was just a lot of mechanics in 3 that didn't work out quite right, not to mention, you know, no guest characters in 3, which kind of sucked. Because, you know, we had so much in 2, and then, you know, 3 just kind of dabbled off with nothing. And then 4 kind of made the gameplay a bit slower, and I guess that's what people didn't really care for, but to me it still felt pretty similar to how it, it's always played. But I guess just everybody was butthurt because they couldn't play as Link. <laughs> That's why they they were just no, we can't play this. It's unplayable. Where's Link? I don't want this this fist fighting nigga. Where's Link? <laughs> or this lame ass spawn like uh, like combo character. Where's Link at? <laughs> yeah. Welcome to but, um, the of history. Retold. But yeah, man. Um. Uh, next we're gonna pick um. Eh, can have a change color and make it look different, and we'll have him fight Pirate Man. <laughs> Yar har fiddle dee dee, being a pirate is all right with me, except when you say the N word on TV, cause that's a bad thing. Though I just did it, I'm sorry, I just say that word a lot. Am white, so I'll be castrated till the end of time. But I always, I don't say it as an offense, that's just part of my vocabulary. As, as, a, as a joke, not that yeah. you take it seriously. Yeah. But, um. <laughs> But yeah, man, it, it feels fluid. But cool thing to add, they added a special thing which I liked. You press R before, like it was kind of like hard. Like you had like go through all these weird conditions to get a special. Where, like, yeah, yeah, it was like this where you had to build the gauge, and I think they had to be at some form of like they had to be a certain amount of health, like the opponent, before you could even do it. But here it just works like a regular special now that you build up and everything. So that's that's always fun. Also, I think. Um, did they bring back? I know with custom, um, there is character customization, of course. Yeah. But did they bring back the ability to like customize the default characters? Like you can make them in fancy outfits, like in the. Damn, that would look good too. Because I don't know, because no one's talked about that. Hey, it, but then again, because everybody can make Bowsette, who cares? <laughs> I've seen it around. I've also seen like a Ronald McDonald, a Ralph from Ed and Nettie. Thanos. Thanos. Yeah. He gets to snap people out of existence. He's really good. Jeez, man. Yeah, she's always been a fun character to use. Better than, um, what was another lady that debuted with her? Setska? Uh, Setska was a terrible character. Because <laughs> she had this weird, like, short sword gimmick, and it didn't combo very well at all. It was just a bunch of one-slashy doodads, and it was very short reach. 
I don't know. I couldn't. I couldn't. You know, jive with Setska. And I mean, it goes to show because she hadn't been back since. Or. I think she's switching personalities. Yeah. Yeah. I think how you do is like you got they do this fashion and she'll switch personalities. Kind of like. And then her fighting stock is a lot more aggressive yeah, she got than more the aggressive uh, there. other form, whereas the <laughs> is more playful with her movements and whatnot. Yeah, see how she's like, oh gosh, I hate this. Uh, I can't believe Koopa said the N word. What a faggot. <laughs> and that word too. Why would you even say that word now? <laughs> now we're gonna get my time. Everyone's gonna judge us and hate us. And I'm gonna be racist, just like how James Gunn is a child molester. FML, dude. FML. I know, right? <laughs> like, even though, which would have better? Uh, the color one. Or color two for Nightmare. Uh, I it, it really doesn't matter. I still like his default better. I don't know, the red and black just looks better than the blue and white. For Nightmare anyway. Mm. Yeah, Nightmare to me always looked dope. You kinda you know, the Yoshi miss with this series, like always changing look. He never looks the same. Though I see though sometimes he goes back and forth between the designs, because this one looks a lot like his uh if I'm thinking right, this is, it's either three or four, Soul Calibur three or four, that that helmet is based he, off on. Hey, Zorn is the name of the monster from Soul Calibur, I mean, uh, from uh, Lord of the Rings, right? Who? The one with the big eye? Sauron, yeah. Yeah, that, that, does it look like brand new Zorn like that? Yeah, that's Sauron, dude. Jeez. He's judging us, he's gonna decide which of these will be his, um, Legionnaire of Mordor to lead his orc armies to victory and rape a bunch of anime waifus. Oh god, I mean, you're like, oh see, then there's just like, you're like, yeah, see, you can do a little clash thing. Or yeah. you can be lame and just guard it. <laughs> That's the best thing to do, because they'll throw them off guard and get like a quick little, like, hit. But, uh, yeah, man, like, yeah, so, it, it, we're ever seeing an anime called Goblin Slayer, it just came out, and like, the first, like the first impression of the episode was like really strong for people. Like, dang, this anime is intense. But uh, let's be honest. If you guys have watched Hentai, it's tame compared oh, to. Oh yeah, so, let's be honest. People like blowing it. <laughs> internet being here, and they're like, oh my god, that reach. You know, so them like... being special flowers. <laughs> like, is it like a big fucking deal? Oh, is she gonna kiss him? I love you, Daddy Nightmare. And it's funny that that's how you ended it, because they have, like, a history together. Oh, really? Yeah. I, well, see, I'm going to the franchise. Because <laughs> I, I didn't really play... I, I mean, I played four. I didn't, didn't play... I mean, I played five a little bit, but, like, I don't know the history of the characters like Koopa does, so... If he says that's the case, then I, I believe it. Although, uh, unfortunately, it didn't, like, end in. Because I noticed it's, like, three rounds. Isn't it default normally, too? No, it's default this game is three for some reason. Well, that's what I mean. Like, the other Soul Calibers, it was yeah. always, like, two. Well, botched it and just threw you like trash. <laughs> I deserve it for getting for missing it like that. I deserve it, honestly. Ah, uh, yes, the Kasame brand throw. <laughs> We're just throwing them like trash. If you don't know what I mean, Clash of Ninja series. By the way, why hasn't that been brought back for the Switch I yet? Know, I know, from Takara told me, what are you guys doing? Mm -hmm. I know the name of the developer. That's how much I love that series. Yeah. What are you guys doing, man? <laughs> Unless it's just that Namco Bandai just forever took the rights and they can't make it. That could be the case, for all we know. Well, right, you know what I do one more? Yeah, go ahead. I have her, I have her, I have her fight my favorite character in the series, Keelik. Bugingi? <laughs> yes, Bugingi. No, yeah, Keelik. Let's have her do Keelik. I was thinking shang Wa. That way we could hear Wendelie Lee. <laughs> Is he in the game? shang Wa, the, the girl. I think she's right above Voldo. Well, I mean, not Voldo. Moshi Yoshimitsu. My bad. Oh, uh, where's... To the left, to the left, to the left. Oh, her? Yeah. Okay. Uh, which one do you like better? One or two? I like two. Right. Just kidding! Let's That's see. what she says. <laughs> and, and, and let's fight in the Hidden Leaf Village. Right. <laughs> because why not? And so far, I'd be wondering... She's amazing. She plays fantastic in the game. Like she always does. Honestly, I'm just seeing this, and it's the same game that she spat in three, but just a lot quicker in my opinion. I think they might have sped her up a bit. 
And I, no, I, I, I like how and I like how that you, you choose different colors, like with other fighting games, you have to pay for freaking other colors. Well, that and I'm pretty sure, even though we don't know it ourselves, we can probably just give them different outfits in general. Yeah. Like, they're probably able to be customized, because it's been there since 4. I don't know why they would take it out all of a sudden now, you know? Yeah, true. But, um... But, uh, I am expecting good things from this game. Oh, I know a fun thing to mention. If we could get more guest characters as DLC, not in the realm of, like, the Soul Calibur series, but in terms of, like, blade wielders in general, or weapon wielders, I should, you know, extend that out to that reach, who would you like to see? If we're talking anime, Ichigo. Because, baby, now you feel like number one? Yeah. Come on, that nice soundtrack. Oh, yes. Shining bright for everyone. <laughs> now, I know, you know what people want, would, wouldn't want, but I would want my, personally to get pissed them off? Kirito. <laughs> Kirito. Oh, he's using dual play. He's an anime character. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, Lord, with me. Boy, you know, I don't... Even now, um, whew, I'm just gonna be sitting here and be like, I posed to you the question, but I don't even know the answer of who I want to see myself because there's just so many options. I, I know those are Nintendo versions. You probably you might see Lucina. Oh yeah, well that's the easy thing, but I doubt we'd even get a, I doubt we'd even get a Switch version to be honest with you. Well, they should. I mean, the Nintendo and Nintendo are good friends. I mean. It, it should be on the rental possible. And then we could get a legit Bowser character <laughs> in would the we, game. Would, would, would Nintendo approve that? No. I mean, as I said in Sonic Adventure, they dabbled in the theory before. Just did, it wasn't public until recently. That's true. With the whole Peach being possessed with like a Bowser crown thing. But. Overall, four? she four. Or, but she she plays fantastic as you saw. The new mechanic says was like a rock paper scissors thing. Like you press square, triangle, or circle, you can like do different attacks to counter them. Oh, the, is the that is that like the flashy animation? Slow mo. Yeah, that's that's what oh, I was. Okay. Or you can like I said be be, be the, like I don't want to do this. I just press X and block. <laughs> but sometimes that's uh, like, at least you have the option to do that. Unlike Budokai, which just forced you into the rock. No, that's the one thing I was. Because sometimes like I was like doing bad against uh, Jiro while I was playing. Uh, I didn't play this game earlier. That's Keelik, and I was going to bag a bag full of new character named Jiro. Something like that. I don't G know. Jiho. I'm, I'm playing a that watching the day. Over there. That <laughs> thought. And I didn't want to do it. I was like, and, Not and, here, though. You're fine. And then like, I was like blocking it, and I was like, oh, okay, I can block it. And then it just took advantage of the attack. That's what I did with it. That's a cool thing about that. And of course, like I said, unlike what Soul Calibur, like the preschool characters, mm -hmm. you got to you know, do 10 push ups, 10 jumping jacks, 10 sit ups. Run for ten miles and then you can do a special. So like, oh, you know what? A character just came to mind that I would like to see in here. What? Velvet from Tales of Basaria. She'd be really fun. And it's Namco Bandai, so yeah, it's not it's not a real. We need a better Tales of representation. Lloyd in the hack and slash one. That wasn't a fair one. True. <laughs> that wasn't a legit go of that. Let's do it over again. Yep. <laughs> All right, guys, but um. Oh, oh, She's like six dollars, in case you're wondering. She's totally worth it. Um, she's, of course, a classic character. They, sh they should have taken. I mean, if you love Soul Calibur, you probably already bought the season pass at this point. So this is just a redundant <laughs> point, but you know. But still, I want to showcase off this game. Of course, when the new, uh, when other characters come out, we'll do videos on this as well. I'm really excited, looking forward to this game. But alright, guys, hope you hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you, Cooper, for joining me. Uh, please ah. make sure to rate, comment, subscribe. Those Rocket Blades signing out. Hope to see you guys again real soon. Peace out. Have a great day. Welcome back to the stage of history. And the creation of Bowsette.